Hello, Richard here from Timberwolf Games and I'll be showing you the latest update for the Indie Dungeon. We'll just get straight into it. Nope. Alright, so I've just added quite a few things since the last video. Um, the most noticeable one is item mode, or if you click T, block mode. Uh, quite a few people had issues with the way that the block worked, that menu worked. So now in block mode, it's left click to play, create a block or right click to create a wall of the selected block. So left click, right click. Pretty simple. And then the item mode is what items you've got on your left and right hand here. So just dig these up. Right, the second most noticeable thing would be the pause menu. We've got rid of the stats and loot and we've totally changed it. Uh, we now have a leveling system which I'll show you in a while but firstly stats they're exactly the same but we've also added trophies which are linked with the Game Jolt account if you log on with Game Jolt. So we'll just go straight back to the menu inventory and blocks more or less the same and then the loot. At the moment it's a work in progress but I like the way it looks. So I've changed the names and colours of every single loot apart from the ores, yeah, the bars. So we've got beryl which used to be coal and all a few ones and lodestone which used to be diamond. Right, these cannot be collected yet, well silver can but not can be done with it. Right, and then you can now enter this house here which is one of my favourite things to this, is slot machines. So you got choice of two, the first one costs 10 gold and these are winnings the second one costs 25 gold and the winnings are a little bit higher sorry about that right so right so we've got 34 gold it costs 10 to have a go so we'll have one go until we get a bit more gold yeah, we didn't win no of course not all right so not much has been changed in the dungeons other than the new ores and um yeah, I've added one new dungeon, which is a parkour dungeon, which will be very randomly generated. And I'm just going to run through here. We did this on the last video. But now, we can now build much easier. Okay. Right. There's a new, two new walls here. Looks a bit like Ruby and Emerald. But it's not. And you also get XP for mining ores, so probably get a level from this one. There we go. At the moment it just goes straight to level up screen and you get a choice of health, attack, defense or speed. I'll go for speed for now, because it also makes you jump higher. Up to loot. And just click these. Okay, we'll leave them. Right, so now we have quite a bit of loot, random loot. We'll go and sell it. Same thing happens as last time. You can just automatic sell them. Yes, 605 gold. That's a nice bit. As you see, we've got a new trophy, which is collect 100 gold, and we also got one for completing the tutorial, which kind of goes off screen. Right, so we now have quite a bit of gold. I'm going to buy myself a whip, I like the whip, and tell you what, we'll spend some on the slot machines just to see what happens when you win, if I win. Oh, that was close. He likes to tease me. Like that, nice. Alright, I just got a trophy for winning quite a bit. Shows you winnings and losses. Losers, yeah, losses. So yeah, that's how you win the lottery. Then um, the lottery, slot machine. How much money do we have now? Seven hundred. It's quite a bit. I think I'll buy the shoes. Make you run quite a lot faster, as you can see. Much needed. All right, I'll try and get us. Find us the parkour dungeon if I can. 
Uh, oh, there's something else I've changed in here as well. I know we've got Lordstone. Up straight off the edge, but I collected the XP. Right, try run straight to the end. If I remember where the end was, there we go. Ah, if you noticed on the last video, I wasn't able to kill that zombie in the water for whatever reason. That's now been fixed. Right, let's do this one. Oh, and sounds for them. <laughs> I really am forgetful. Okay. Oh dear. That was not nice. Oh. I forgot. Yeah. Give me some loot. Very nice of him. Right. No. Oopsie. Alright, so I've just come across a parkour dungeon. As you can see, it's pretty easy, simple. Uh, it's not randomly generated other than the, the blocks. And in the top left corner, it tells you you cannot place blocks, so no matter how much you try, you can't place a block. Just to make it that much, that little bit difficult. And stop from cheating, I guess. Uh, there's a chest up in the left corner, top left. Honest. Right, yeah, nice and easy. Uh, if you man you can't find to manage to get out, there's spikes here, which should hurt you, yeah, on the occasion. Yeah, alright, so thanks for watching. The link will be in the description for this game, as always, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.